Hey everyone, it's Josh. I know it's been like a week since I last recorded, but I had other things to attend to. The Armageddon Expo, which is held every year in New Zealand. And, and you know, it just didn't feel right recording with that. Um, so, this is the first video for, since then. Um, God damn, I'm forgetting how to record it already. <laughs> uh, we, I'm really lucky to be joined by a special guest as today. One of my favourite people from the Criminal Minds Wiki Discord. One of my best friends who you may remember uh, from the Among Us stream this video a couple of weeks ago. The amazing cat. Hello. It just oh, that was weird, it cut you off for a second there. Um anyway, today we're playing one of the earliest games developed by a Carmel Games with actually surprisingly good animation for its time. Uh, we're playing Luke. I'll be voicing all of the male characters and Cat will be voicing all of the female characters. So this will be interesting. Ready, Cat? Ready when you are. Let's get into it then. Okay, so obviously right here our choices are more games, which takes us to the uh, probably the website, the sponsor's website. Uh, we have options. Not that really we want to go with any of these, but you know they're there if we need them. So. Let's let's hit new game. Son, we're broke. We've spent all the money my last husband had. Then we should find you a new husband. Yes, but where can we find us a new sucker? Hmm. It says here that his name is Luke. He is looking for the love of his life. That's us. <laughs> I can't do a very good evil laugh, not really, but I try. It was a pleasure to meet you, Alexis, but I don't think we should see each other again. What? You want me to marry you? No, it was our first date ever, I said. That's wonderful. Of course I'll marry you. My son Damien will be so excited. What? You have a son? Yeah, and I'm so excited! Listen, lady. No, you listen. We're getting married tomorrow, and you'd better do exactly as I say if you ever want to see the light of day again. Now, go and make reservations for our honeymoon at the Heartbreak Hotel. Buy yourself a nice wedding suit and set a date for the chapel. For tomorrow. This book might come in handy. I mean, considering what happens at, a, at that hotel, it's it's a good name. I'd rather not talk to him right now. Ugh. Uh, right. Let's start with the chapel first. Uh, dig for trash. Hmm, an empty cup. Great, so someone dropped the uh, so someone lost their Starbucks basically. <laughs> <laughs> At least it's empty, I guess. That's gotta be a good thing. Hmm. Uh ah. Yeah sure. I put some holy water in the cup. I would definitely find a use for it. I mean, yeah, probably. Holy water in a cup. 
How convenient! <laughs> Hello, I would like to sit as eight for a waiter. We're very busy today. How about tomorrow at 2 p.m.? Well, oh, it's so tempting to choose the. He would send. It's so tempting to choose the, the December 1st, 2072 option, but... Hmm. Ah, I'll go for it. How about December 1st, 2072? No, no, no. Set the date for tomorrow. Exactly as my beloved mother said. Alright, tomorrow, PM. See ya. She gave me the wrist. The receipt for the wedding reservation. I'll put it in my backpack. <sighs> well, I could not, and I just could not resist. I don't know if they'd even take bookings that far in advance. Hmm, they probably wouldn't, honestly, but. Eh, it's something. Uh, we'll pick up the leaflet, that'll come in handy for something. I'm sure. I mean, hey, you can pick it up in an adventure game, it's basically... You're gonna come in handy. Uh... Click. Hello. I want to make a reservation for the honeymoon... ...in suite. Scratch your chin. What date would you like to make the reservation for? How about tomorrow? She gave me the receipt for the hotel reservation. I'll put it in my backpack. As tempting as it was to make the same him joke this time, it just wasn't worth it. What can I get you, my friend? Shirley Temple. That is quick. Drank a whole drink as if it was a shot. The man must be a professional or something. A professional alcoholic. <laughs> I wonder if that's even a thing. Lots of people seem to try. That's true. It comes with three sugar cubes. I'll keep two for later. Uh, swimming pool, may as well get that over with as well. What can I get you, sir? Bring me a cup of tea with lots of sugar. I'm sorry, but I'm out of sugar. Alright, just bring me the tea then. Coming right up. That was quick. Right. May as well get that other one out of the way now. Oh, that poor bird. Well, I mean, it seems to be still alive, just a little grumpier. Electricity resistant birds. What will they think of next? <laughs> Hello, I need to buy a suit for my wedding. What kind of a suit are you looking for? I don't know. I don't want to get married. I just had a date with a psychotic woman, and I have no idea how to get her to leave me alone. Here, take this ugly suit. I hope it'll do the trick. Thanks. I'll put the suit in my backpack. Well, this is going to make it even more wrinkled. Also, I'm in no way, and also, I just want to let you know I'm not a calling you psychotic. It's the character. Separated from the character. Exactly. Yes. Yes, you and the character are very distinct people, so... I'll take that water pitcher with me, and I'm sure that flute will come in handy for something. I did all you told me, but I'm not happy with... But I... Shut up! Now go back and get a new suit. But... Now! And on your way, buy my 
my sweet Damien some sugar-free candy. Remember, no sugar makes him really hyperactive. I'm sure that's supposed to be a hint for later. <laughs> I guess it must be. Hmm. Well, did it work? She saw the suit and ran away. Nope. She complained it's all wrinkled up. Now I need to get a new one. I simply can't get rid of that crazy woman. I just sold my last suit. I'll iron this one for you. Come and pick it up later. Where is my sugar-free candy? I want it now. Hmm, I wonder what would happen if I played the flute next to the suspiciously Indian and snake charmer's looking basket. Very convenient. Yes. That was also very convenient. <laughs> Interesting. This is, a, this is a hotel reservation for today. Made by Damien himself. You know, I just spotted and I just realized the relevance of Damien's name. Damien was the uh, the evil child in the the Omen horror movie. Oh, oh, that's a good one. Yeah, fantastic movie. Hello there. I have this reservation here. I see. Let me give you the key to your room. Two on the eighth floor. Thanks. I like the drawings. <laughs> They're really cute, actually. If I mean, this kid could make a living as an artist. You know, when he's grown up. Because that is he not... If you like this now, he'll get a lot better. Definitely. <laughs> I mean, here, heck. Um... I mean, that's better than my drawings. Thanks when I was as a teenager. So, like, ten years ago now. And, I mean, you've seen in my drawings in the art that section of of the the service so that right yeah yeah that's yeah i mean i've got a lot better over the years but hmm. oh <laughs> i didn't even read the bit of dialogue mm, that evil kid do 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 do. It's an SMS from Alexis. Let's she see what she wants. Ow. Hi dear, me and your son to be are waiting for you at the hotel swimming pool. Come quick, love you. I hope it'll freeze soon. Well, we might as well. We've got nothing better to do till this. It's, uh, to the ice freezes. Damien, be careful your rubber duck doesn't touch me. I'm ticklish. All oh, right, we already got the tea. What am I doing? Use that on that. Hmm. That's an interesting idea. Hmm. <clears throat> I'm sure that's supposed to, and I'm sure that's referencing or just saying that the holy water's really cold, but I don't know. Hmm. It's certainly done something to mess them up. Yes. I'm not even going to bother with that. You'll give yourself a stroke. Yeah, I'm just going to say, um... Muffles... 
gibberish, basically. But insert, um, insert muffled gibber gibberish here. <laughs> What's wrong? Damien, somebody do something. Oh, I'll do something, all right. Five 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 three four three and five 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 three four three seven. I just need a and I just need Alexis to look a bit more possessed, and then I'll call them. Okay. Good ice. Wow, it's cold. I mean, what does he expect? It's Ice, like from the I freezer. Think ice is often be cold. Yes, I mean, wouldn't be ice if it wasn't cold. So, yeah. You know, if it wasn't for the fact she was purple, Alexis is actually really, really pretty looking. Even when doing the funky chicken. Well. <laughs> eh. So. I suppose not so much now, but ignoring the psychopathy, yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Makes me think Damien's father must have had a uh, blonde in here as well, because otherwise there's no way that Damien would have had blonde here. Oop. <laughs> okay, now that's... And yeah, that's definitely a possessed look. Good thing I memorized the number. Five, 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 three, four, three, seven. Hello, Professor Pritchard. I need your help. How may I help you? I'm, uh, uh, I'm at the Heartbreak Hotel, and there's this woman and her son here. I think they're possessed. I'll be right over. Thank you, Luke, for calling me. Now I can try my new exorcism nuclear device. Well, that sounds dangerous. Go for it! So wait, is Luke basically encouraging murder here? That's the question. If you want, I can tell you all about it over dinner tonight. I would be delighted. So, do you believe in love at first sight, or should I walk by again? <laughs> oh my god, that, that was... That pick-up line at the end is just... Wow, it's awful. Very cheesy. <laughs> well, um... That's Luke. There's there's also a second. There's also an updated version called Luke Deluxe for the same developers, which was released a couple of years ago in his voice acting. I'll be doing that as a separate a game later on, obviously. Um. Thank you so much for hanging out with me this time. Aim, I really appreciate it. Thank you for having me. It was a pleasure, it really was. Um... Well... Not sure what else to say, really, um... I hope we can, and I'd love to work together there on some more videos in the future even if it's not necessarily even if it doesn't even necessarily have to be ones where we do voice it think it could just be I don't know we play through something to get we play a multiplayer game on Steam or something or I don't know we'll see how it goes yeah anyway Oh, absolutely. There's no denying that. 
Um, anyway, yes, thank you so much. This was a lot of fun, and uh, I guess all that's left now is my outro. Um, so I guess if you've enjoyed the video, like racing is very much appreciated. Blah blah blah, subscribe. <laughs> uh, um, subscribe. Don't forget to hit the, notifi the notification bell. Leave a comment, share, whatever. There it is. And all my social media links are in the description box down below. That's my Facebook, Twitter, Discord, the profile number thing, and my Instagram. I'll be putting a link to your or Instagram profile in the a description as well, Kat, since you know you were my you basically co recorded this with me. So thank you and again, thank you so much. This was a pleasure and I'll see you guys next time. Until then, Josh, out. <coughs> um, you want to say goodbye to Cat or? Bye everyone. Thank you for having me, Josh. You're welcome. Bye. <laughs>